Welcome back. Halloween is right around the corner, as we know. And to help you get into the season a bit, we're sharing our pumpkin carving tips. All right. So we've all, well, I say that loosely. We've been working on these pumpkins. In reality, our amazing associate producer, Bella, is doing so much of the heavy lifting. And may I just say, she's done an incredible job. Yes. Yeah, and this, was, this happened all morning behind the scenes, literally behind our weather office or yeah. weather center. So thank you. Thank you to Bella for thank carving you, Bella. this. Thank you, Bella. over there, guys. Yes. All right, so do we want to start over uh, showing off each one? Yeah. I like yours, sir, yes. Yeah, I drew a little eyebrow on it. Oh my God, you guys can't really see it. See there it? we go. Well, oh, well, that even looks awful. Only one awful. eyebrow, though. <laughs> Only the, it's <laughs> what Halloween. happened to the other one? It's Halloween. Oh, okay, Hold okay. on, let me make it thicker, because right, you, know, you yeah. can't really see it too much. Oh, but. now I see it. OK. You see? Unibrow for Halloween, Frankenstein inspired. OK. It still looks awful, though, on there. I'm sorry. OK, Ashley, you go. I saw oh, my God. OK, so <laughs> this this one is almost too pretty for words. Like, I, it, I'm not sure, but I think Kenna, our executive producer, may have done this one. Oh, yeah. That's this, perfect, actually. So I say, this should be in a, in, in a movie or something. Something. Give it a name. I feel like it needs a name. Oh, for the love of all things holy, a name? Okay, um, well, how about Michael Myers? Michael Myers, I, mean, I love that. <laughs> all right, let's see yours, Steve. All what right, so this it? is, of course, uh, the television station you're watching, the local station, Channel 4. So this was actually Ashley's idea. We're going to flip <laughs> it around. This is what happened. Yeah. So one of the key components of doing a pumpkin is you kind of have to plan things out ahead of time. Yes. And if you notice, our logo there, logo at the very bottom of the screen has that little orange in the center. Mm -hmm. Can't recreate that on a pumpkin. No. So Bella wisely gave this up, and we turned it around. And now you have a very plain, easy to read. Four. I love it. It's very news for Jax. I mean, it could have been worse. So we were also talking to Bella about some of the best uh, ways to do this. And okay, so this is what we used. Yes. Oh, wait a minute. No, this is what she used. Mm -hmm. And this one too a little bit. Okay. I guess it just depends on really what you're trying to carve. I think probably for like the smaller ones, you'd want to use this one. Mm -hmm. But to be honest, it's pretty, you know, these pumpkins are pretty thick. It's not easy to cut through. So they are. So she said definitely have a nice serrated edge. Is that what you, that's what you were telling us. And definitely put some elbow grease into it, right? Yeah, let's here, you well, try let's it do the, the van. Oh, uh, and here's more tips. It looks like cut from the bottom, which is opposite of what I did when I was little. We always cut the top off and then yeah, hold it off. And then dig and, it out. Yeah, in fact, if you notice here on camera, uh, the bottoms are gone. So we actually followed the advice. Well, whoever yeah. I, I was it uh, our EP who did this? Yeah, I think it was. OK, yeah. yeah. So so Kenna, who who unplugged these pumpkins, they yeah, carved from the bottom. Yeah, she did it the smart way. Which I guess you're supposed to I, do. Yeah, I did. I have, oh, when yeah, I was younger, I did cut it from the top. I'll have so to ask my mom about that, why we did it wrong all those yeah, years. Yeah, all those years, oh, even oh, in school. Well, yeah. We're learning something new today, guys. All right, and you can draw your drawings with your dry erase marker. That's a good thing, too. And if you accidentally cut the wrong part, well, you can super glue the pumpkin back on. Hmm, I never thought about that one. Yeah, I never thought about it either. Well, I, you know, I'm not going to lie. Pumpkin carving is a lot of work. Shout out to Bella for helping us yes. do these amazing pumpkins. Because honestly, I am not this crafty. You saw my oh. unibrow. It's crooked. <laughs> um, oh. But thank you so much. We hope you guys have an amazing Halloween. And show us your pumpkins on Snapjacks. Upload your photos if you're planning to carve anything. Absolutely. But we'll be right back after the break. Ooh.